How do solar photovoltaic cells work? It takes a few steps to get electricity from sunlight to our homes, and the first step is the photovoltaic or solar cell. The solar cell consists of two different silicon layers, an upper one which is negatively charged using phosphorus, and a lower one which is positively charged using boron. Because the silicon layers are differently charged, an electric field arises that creates a voltage between them. The voltage means that electrons from the upper layer have difficulty moving towards the lower one. When the sun's rays hit the electrons that are bound in the lower layer, they are released and get enough energy to move to the upper one. Due to this, a deficit of electrons is created in the lower layer, which causes it to start attracting electrons. Since the electrons cannot travel freely between the layers, a metal circuit is connected between them. The electrons use the circuit to travel from the upper layer back to the lower one. It is from this metal circuit that we can extract electricity. This whole process goes on like a cycle as long as the sun's rays hit the solar cells. The electricity generated by solar panels is direct current, DC, while most of our appliances use alternating current, AC. This is why we need another step, which is an inverter. The inverter can convert the DC into AC, which can then be used by all the appliances in our homes. And finally, from the inverter, the electricity can be directed to all your home appliances. Alternatively, you can also store it in a solar battery to be used later. Without the battery, all the excess electricity will be sent to the national grid, and you can even earn some money for each unit you export under the Smart Export Guarantee. If you want to get started with solar panels, we can help you get up to four quotes from local installers, free and non-binding. Just fill in our form, the link is in the description.